Salutations, my fellow kids. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys my Fallout 4 cardboard laser pistol that I made. Now, I do actually, I did actually make the lightning gun from Doom today, but it did not turn out how I wanted it because I used the twisted spinner box. So it didn't turn out how I wanted it to. And, um, I was like, hey, why don't I just make a Fallout weapon today? So I did. Here it is. The Fallout 4 laser pistol. I know it's a little bit bigger than your average pistol, but that's what it's supposed to be. That's what it's supposed to be like in the game. It's a bit larger than most pistols. And, uh, weighs a bit more, too. But, um, here it is. I know a bunch of people are going to comment and say that this looks more like the Institute pistol, but my bad. So, yep, obviously I did use the twisted spinner box, so this side has, like, some light on it. This part doesn't. Um, yep. And uh, I did actually do the capacitor, which is something I usually don't do on guns like this. But um, it does actually have a capacitor right here. So on one side, um, it says caution, and then it's pointing this way. And then on the other, the other side, I just put it on both sides. Um, I only made one. I'll probably make another one, though. And how it actually inserts is in the game how the how you take out the capacitor is there's this thing that's holding it in and then you flip that down and then take it out at the same time. Put it back in and then flip it back up. But I could not figure out how to do that so what you do is there's this piece right here that you fold like this so now it's facing toward you. You slide it, you go on this side, slide it in. And then it fits in. Perfect. Uh, what I tried is if you actually flip this all the way down, <clears throat> it won't actually fit in there. And um, just for a size comparison, here it is with a skull surge. And it's about the same size as a skull surge. You can see there. Yep, it's about as big as a school surge. So, yep, except this one doesn't have that annoying thumb to stop. So, um, its cool features is obviously it uses the capacitor, but it does look a little bit weird without it in there. Um, what I should have done is made it where, like, it's on the side, like this, instead of having it, like, held into the gun, because now, whenever you take it out, it just looks... There's just like a gaping hole, and I don't really like that I did that. I'll probably fix that, but um, I probably won't be able to. Uh, the trigger is right here. Uh, this is the uh, pumping part, whatever this is supposed to be. It's from the game. Uh, the handle is actually really big, so it's pretty comfortable. Uh, adults would still be okay with this. And uh, on this side, I drew the... Um, muzzle part it has in the game so yeah i'm probably making the laser rifle next and um i didn't actually make this i'm not gonna spoil what this is for but um i am actually going i did actually i did make this for fun so um and uh, i'll show you what this means by when i say that it's larger than most pistols look at that this thing is small compared to this. Maybe I should make a bigger 10 millimeter pistol. Yeah, I'm gonna make a bigger one. I'm still gonna keep the other one, but I'm gonna make another one that's bigger. So, um, yep. There is the, um, Fallout cardboard, um, laser pistol replica that I made. Um, be sure to like and subscribe to BKade and go over to GTV. Subscribe to him and and break that like button in half and break my like button in half. Thank you guys for watching. Peace and bye. And remember, stay BK.